All right. We've just dealt with the uh, sand ship and the mech riders and all that crap. And now we're getting away to Karaka. we got one of these losers. Oh, a couple of them. Jeez. Man, they're in sync. Welcome to Kakara. Kakara. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Anything else? Come again. I might have better gear than that already. Yeah, I already have the golden vests and uh, at least a couple of these silver bands. I took a visit to the ice country before I started the other episode and bought the armor that they had there. Because I knew it would be easier to get it. Chest guard. Anyway, golden vest. The girl doesn't have a golden vest. Anything else? Anything else? Okay, and get one more of these. Anything else? Come again. Somebody doesn't have a golden vest. Sprite. Sprite's the one that doesn't have his crap. At the very least, I can sell that last band, though. I've been burning through all my money. Alright, this town is suffering from an unfortunate uh, lack of water. The drought. This little ora oasis, I guess, is what they all survived on. And that's gone. <laughs> Watts should be around here somewhere. There he is. That's not enough money. 800? Ah, oh, damn. I can't do it. <laughs> oasis. What oasis? Someone's nabbed Salamander, the keeper of the fire palace. What's more, the fire seed is gone, and monsters have taken over the whole place. Candy? Candy? Who do you think I am? Listen. I'm King Amar the Third, ruler of this realm. But that's not important now. The oasis is bone dry and my kingdom is in shamble. A man named Gemma said that the mana seed's been stolen from the palace to the west. Alright, so we're sort of stuck in a bind here. Um, because here we are. We are, um... In Kakar, we gotta go and... Country. We've got to go and seal the mana seed, but it's been stolen, and Salamando's the fire spirit's gone missing as well. So we got to go and hop our asses over to Ice Country in an attempt to get our ship going, get it back. Enemies are a little tougher here, and they tend to, uh, jump in large numbers. Prim's 19. Oh, shit. Oh! Try not to get hit all the time. Hey, like that shit. All three of you get hit by one... one attack. <laughs> Come on, Balto. Die. Keep it coming. Stop dodging my attacks. Uh... 
Oh, such a pain in the ass in this game. There we go. Something I always used to do in the original version was before I went and I stayed at an inn, I would stand outside of it and just spam cure water. So that way I would um, level up Udine as much as I possibly could. Because it was it's really the spell you're going to be using most throughout the game. And you want it to be as powerful as you can, as you can get it. Oh, my master has gone. They're all gone. That monster is the... I think the monster's got my master. The monster's got my master. Santa's house. Got a picture of Abraham Lincoln on the wall. Ooh, a spear orb. How much money do I have? Okay, that is enough. That is enough to upgrade. All right, Wants is inside this building in this town. Just follows you around. What kept you? I've been freezing my ears off. You need help with your weapons? <laughs> well, I got the spear orb. And I got this one, and nothing else. <laughs> oh, you know what? I meant to not upgrade the spear for a while on account of it um, ballooning the enemies. Ah, uh, oh well. Might as well see... Well, I do need the rest anyway. Might as well see what the characters have to say while we're here. I wonder if Pamela and Dylok are alright. I doubt it. Worried? They'll be okay. Thanks. Just be patient and you'll see. Your hard work won't be in vain. Listen up. Success is a mental thing. You gotta visualize it going well or you're never gonna get anywhere. Besides, we're gonna help you along the way. When we can, at least. Thank you so much. Well, what kind of boss doesn't look out for their underlings? Leave it to me. I never agreed to be your underling. But thanks for the thought. Tomorrow's another day. Let's get some rest. Alright, continuing on from here. Hmm. Gotta be a little bit careful. I mean, I don't even have to move anywhere. I can see exactly where the pathways are on the map. Like, I, just on a normal screen, it looks like it can go down, left, or right. But really, on the map, I can see it can only go right. Two of them. Critical hits. Gotta love them. This new spear is nice. Even though the uh, the ballooning thing is gone. That's a bit of a pain. Randy, level 21. I don't know what exactly that's gonna result in in terms of stats. It's been a while since I checked out the character stats. So, uh, this is a cannon travel center here. So I'm not going to go in there. Let's, uh, let's burn a candy. On, on girl to make sure that she doesn't die. And, you know, I'll probably pick up candy further along in the, in the game in order to, uh, just add a treasure chest, you know? Alright, he's 21 compared to her. Still not too big of a difference in terms of level, but you still see the difference in terms of stats. What makes him the best uh, melee character? She lands somewhere in the middle and the sprite's the weakest. Gotta love them, they're criticals. Especially against these pain in the ass wolves. Pebblers are still a pain in the ass. Even though we're a lot more powerful now. Because they're just hard to hit. 
They have high defense, too. You're not dead yet? I'm not gonna fight you. Ah, oh, what is that? <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Die already. Hello. Oh, damn you. Chocolate. Should have used the chocolate. I was thinking that wolf didn't die. Oh, the cloud monsters. I think you gotta, uh... You gotta use magic on those things, and... I don't think it's really worth it to use magic on a, uh... On a regular enemy. Oh, friggin' hell. Okay, boss battle. And of course, Sprite's unconscious. Miss. Not much in the way of damage I'm doing to this thing. I don't know what this thing's weakness is. Sort of like, um, what was it called? Tropicano or something? The enemy that was in, um, the gnome or the dwarf village. Of course, it's quite a common thing in RPGs for enemies to be reused because they didn't, like, you're gonna put all this time for, like, this throwaway fight, really, is what this is. not like crucial to the storyline or anything. It was just here because they needed a boss battle right here before we get to the next town. So, we're going to create an entirely new enemy design. Just to recolor an existing sprite. Of course, this isn't even a sprite anymore, but it's pretty well established that this is the monster we're going to be encountering at this part of the game, so they just got to follow with that, because this is a, a remake, you know. Got the bow orb. What the hell? <laughs> Welcome to the tropics and snow country. Neat, huh? Yeah, bro. No matter how much snow there is out there, in this place it's always summer. Fabulous, no? Tourist destinations. I moved here from Gold City. Thanks. Only the most elite own a second house here. It's the fashion. <laughs> Alright, of course it's the Scorpion Army stole. Everyone around has deep pockets. It ain't cheap to live here. These high class folks got over their typical spending and decided to spend their money in this place. It's a Scorpion Army that stole Salamando and ah, this new place is gonna be gorgeous! That and stuck it in that furnace in order to keep this area all tropical and crap. Hey, look what it is. A hit. Minion. Oh, there's a bunch of you. But the boss ain't got time for layabouts. Take a breather and you get camp. This second 
house of ours is You'd be fired. So glad my wife found this place. This picture here. Character. I can't see it too well because it's kind of small. Looks familiar though. It's got to be a reference to something. keep this entire place warm. Wouldn't standing next to it, you know, kill you? Huh? I heard something. Should I open it? Yeah, why well, the hell not? Ooh, hey, I'm the fire elemental salamander. Use me as a heater, huh? Well, they'll get more heat than they bargained for. All right, we gained a new elemental. <laughs> Not you again, you dolts! Didn't you recognize them? Aren't you a little cold to be dressed like that? Uh, sorry. This was the perfect money-making scam. Now everyone's gone. Huh? The seed from the fire palace. How should I know? I've had enough of man. We saw some weird old group when we nabbed Salamando. I suspect that I'll get away with this. Alright, now that we got Salamando, this entire place has turned into a frozen hellhole. Oh, you can go in the building. Hey, it's still warm in here. But everyone's gone. So there's no point in being here. There was never any shops or anything here anyway. So I proclaim this town mine, and I shall never return. But well, let's take a ganders at our new abilities. Flame sword. Fire bouquet and blaze wall. Now this is um, this is girl's magic powers. She um, first time she's really gaining straight up offensive powers. Spray. Just straight up offense in this case. Fireball, exploder, and lava wave. I don't know why we need all these different magic attacks. They more or less all do the same thing. Attack. Some are more effective than others, of course. But, you know. But anyway, there we go. 